So I don't know if enough people have said it yet, but I just first off want to say thank you to SWK for inviting us in for a second year to be a sponsor and present here. So we really appreciate just, you know, the entire team at SWK has been awesome. And give it up for Antonio and his marketing team. He did a great job today. So thank you. Um, so yeah, as Antonio mentioned, uh, you may not have heard of Avid Exchange. Uh, you probably will soon enough. As he mentioned about MasterCard, we're actually going live at the end of this month. Uh, they're launching a new B2B payments hub with about 275 banks nationwide. A couple of big ones are Fifth Third Bank, Key Bank, et cetera. And uh, we've been really strong for about I went past 18 years in the real estate property management space. We're now uh, going heavy into the ERP space for the past four or five years. Uh, I did recently manage the entire Sage and Microsoft channel. Thankfully, uh, we've hired more people, so I'm now focusing on just our top strategic partners, of which SWK is at the top of that list. So we're really excited about that. Um, and I did double check, somebody asked me during the break, uh, we were on the top 10 list of financial tech software companies, so we're in good company with folks like SoFi and PayPal and others. I think we were number nine on the list, so we literally just hit that list uh, last year on the, now the Forbes Cloud 100, which is kind of cool. Um, so how about this, uh, this slide here, does this look familiar to anybody, all that, the stacks of invoices and paper checks, you know, I'm seeing some nodding heads, yes. <laughs> So um, I'm not going to read this in detail. It's kind of an eye chart. But essentially what Avid Exchange does is um, we give you more visibility and control into your AP automation processes. So simplifying the ability of managing those invoices, the workflow approvals, the cutting of checks. Uh, we have a simplified software solution that all runs in the cloud, integrates with Sage and other ERP systems. And uh, we have a managed service offering, which is really the value add that a lot of other companies don't do. So we actually have a call center of folks that actually do vendor management and enrollment for you to help them move off of paper checks to an electronic form of payment. We have indexers that uh, they work around the country. So as those invoices are coming in, either we're scanning them in on your behalf, which is a huge time saver, or they're coming in via email. And maybe there's an error on the invoice. And our indexers are catching those errors. And they're sending you an email, hey, is this invoice really for 1100 or is it for 1200 Because I see this $100 tip written in red ink that maybe your doc management system didn't pick up. So having those, those additional people components, we found, has been a really key differentiator for us. And in fact, uh, you know, the other great thing is being able to do this on your phone. I was joking with uh, John from Blue Scholar this, uh, during one of the breaks this morning, and he said, yeah, I was on Avid Exchange this morning. I rolled out of bed on my phone. I approved a couple of invoices, and I was done. So it's really, he, in fact, he even, his, his words, not mine, said it transformed his entire AP process at the company, which is kind of cool. So thanks, John, for being a customer in Blue Sky. Uh, and I also, just like I did last year at the Empower Conference in Phoenix, uh, we had Vivian Barnes, who was the CFO of Ackerman and Company, talking about her experience with Avid Exchange. We did the same thing this year. So I've got a little video here I'm going to play uh, from Rebecca Beam, who's the controller at the Maxwell Group. She talks about her experience with Avid as well. No audio. No audio. Go back. There you go. Try now. Company's biggest motivation for automating was a couple of different reasons, actually. Um, our AP process in general was just very inefficient. So the way it was working previously is our invoices would first show up at the campus. Someone there would have to open the mail, distribute to the different department heads. Um, the approval process was manual. They were signing off on those invoices manually. And then they were going to the executive director at that location also to do a manual sign off. The invoices then would be FedEx to our home office where our AP clerks would enter those invoices into our accounting system. And then once they were entered, that's when we were then able to pay. So from start to finish, an invoice would probably take somewhere from 30 to 45 days before we could even um, pay that invoice. Um, secondly, we're all, always looking for new opportunities to grow. So we have a couple of properties that are currently um, in the um, construction phase. We also um, are looking for acquisition opportunities. So we needed a process that was scalable and um, 
we felt like the Avid Exchange program was something that we could bring on a new property and easily incorporate them into our AP processes without hiring another AP clerk. And finally, we just needed a little bit of visibility into um, the invoices that were circulating in our company. Um, so we were finding invoices that were showing up to the home office that were three, four, even a year old. Um, so the Avid Exchange program gives us the opportunity um, to have a little more visibility into um, the invoices that we need to have posted into our accounting um, software for this time period. So pretty cool, huh? Um, so, you know, much like SWK, and I think that's one of the reasons why we have such a great partnership, we are truly vested in the success of our customers. And, uh, you know, as Alan just talked about transforming the business, trying to help you guys be more strategic, we really want to help you get off some of these old kind of what I call the dark ages of, of AP. So to that end, we'll do a quick audience poll. So who's here still writing paper checks? Okay, you know they have flying cars in Dubai, right? No, I'm just kidding, okay. Um, how about uh, who handles the vendor calls? Where's my payment? Where's my payment? Yes, no? You like those vendor calls? Right during audit time, tax time? Love it, yeah, right? No, nobody likes that. So uh, the reality is, again, Avid Exchange helps uh, automate that. We take all that pain out of your day and we manage it for you and it, it really simplifies and makes, lets you be a lot more strategic. Do things like negotiating vendor contracts, negotiating early pay discounts, things like that. So at the end of the day, uh, you know, what are the benefits of automating, eliminating paper invoice and checks, uh, reducing those manual labor tasks like Rebecca just talked about stuffing envelopes and FedEx and uh, or stuffing checks and FedEx envelopes which was a huge waste of time uh, shortening your approval times we joke about John at Blue Sky being able to just be on his mobile phone rolling out of bed and approving invoices you can be on the road we just had another customer uh, true story she was actually in Rome Italy and she was texting her salesperson at Avid saying thank you Avid Exchange I'm on vacation in Rome with my husband and I'm approving invoices and payments out here in Rome so thank you and she's carrying her little Avid Exchange backpack around which was kind of cute um, again visibility it was probably one of our number one uh, benefits we hear time and time again the ability to during audit time imagine the auditor comes in and says hey I need a copy of check 43526 where is it now you go filing through your right your filing cabinets you're calling your bank where's the copy of this check with avid exchange we keep copies of every single invoice every single remittance it's all in the cloud give the auditor read-only access let them look it up and save you from the time of having to do it yourself so uh, a lot of folks like that capability and then uh, fraud uh, we had I'm out in Houston Texas we had uh, Memorial Herman it was a real embarrassment they had an AP manager uh, that came in didn't know didn't realize didn't do a background check realized this guy was out of jail in 10 years and he figured out a way to create all these dummy accounts and dummy PO boxes in the Houston area siphoned off almost 10 million dollars took three years they caught him he's in jail again but you know again they siphoned off 10 million it took three years and uh, you know the embarrassment to Memorial Herman was was pretty pretty bad and then last but not least eliminating the duplicate payments um, you know we have a lot of those safe safety controls and compliance built into our product which really makes it a lot easier for you so again we're we are laser focused on helping you automate your AP processes so, you know, uh, just like Alan said, I'll say the same thing. So what's the, what's the next step or the call to action here? Uh, as I mentioned, we have a phenomenal relationship with SWK, very strategic. Um, they're one of our uh, national reseller partners. We don't have very many of those. And so SWK is right now one of the only ones, actually the only one in the Sage space. So uh, if you're interested in learning more about this, Talk to your, uh, your corporate account manager, uh, ask them to get on a quick discovery call. Uh, most likely be Santiago de la Lama back here is at the table. He manages our West region. Uh, so folks that are here in California, um, and he'll tell you within 30 minutes. He's pretty straight up, straight shooter. He'll say, right, Santiago, you're a straight shooter? Yeah, so he'll say, hey, this is a fit or not a fit, right? So uh, if you're doing a very small number of invoices or checks, it may not be a fit, but if, trust me, for some of you folks I've talked to are doing 500 or more invoices, checks a month, uh, this is going to be a really good fit. It's going to transform your business and uh, definitely give you more hours back in your day. So thank you, everyone, for your time, and uh, go to the next speaker.